Godspeed to the speedy tribe, man. Grand risings to all. Hey, man, I'm, I'm getting, I'm right out the gate with it, man. Um, yo, those who forget the past are deemed to repeat it. Those who forget their past are deemed to repeat it. Let me tell you something, man. In the past is lessons. In the future, it's blessings. What do I mean by that? So we all go through crazy shit. We all go through all these things, right? In the past. And we want to forget about the past only because it caused so much pain and turmoil and, you know, just so much compromising issues amongst ourselves and the people around us that we want to forget it. I say no. I say don't forget anything in the past because back then, what you was going through is preparing you for what you're in right now or what you're going to be heading into in the future. You can't deviate from the past because it's part of your life. It makes you, it makes you who you are. Don't forget the pain you had to go through. Don't forget the compromising, the the demises you had to go through. You know, through do through, through, through those through, through those circumstances that you were dealt. We spend so much time trying to mask what we went through, right? Patch up. We don't even matter of fact. We don't even patch up pieces. You know, you ever see like a boat with a big ass hole in it? You putting little pieces of tape on it. You know the water gonna get through that shit, right? So what you gotta do is you gotta patch up the pieces. But while you're patching up the pieces, while you're looking at that hole, that while you're looking at that little hole, you detailing. You like, all right, I'm examining this. You know, which is the problem, which is the past, which is that thing you went through in the past, right? You examining it, and then you're figuring out a solution to make this hole close or fix the hole so water won't get through it. Get what I'm saying? And then now, now what you just built yourself is intellectual property. So now you got the, the now you got the mindset of how to patch up pieces when it's there, when the, where there's holes in the wall, where there's holes in the boat, where there's holes in your life. Patch it up. Don't forget it though. Patch it up, but don't forget how you came up with a solution that was conducive for your life and your divine purpose. I know y'all all dealing with people right now, or y'all are people of the of the y'all are the people I'm talking about. Repeating the same things you repeated in your past, not learning from it. So, because you're learn because you're not learning from it, you're not gonna get your blessing in the future. The future is the future is the, uh, a second from now. The future is a minute from now. The future is a week from now. The future is a year from now. A month from now. But what are you getting from the past to prepare you for that? That's the real question. Because I'm telling you, man, you don't learn from it, you won't earn from it. You don't learn from it, you won't earn from it. So you got to patch up pieces. You got to go back. You got to backtrack. You got to internalize that pain. You got to. You got to. But you got to let it be a driving positive force, not a drive driving negative force. You got to have you got to allow it to be a driving positive force to propel you forward to an upper echelon. Right. Spark your clairvoyance, spark your inner being, spark all these things that's stemming from that. Right. And just transmute it into positive forward moving energy. Because then that's when you healing people and things around you. And you will want that. Right. We all want that. Right. So that's why I say, learn from the past, man. Learn from it. Learn from it, and then you'll start earning from it in the future. All right? Listen, T-shirts, man, available, man. If y'all want to be part of Speedy Tribe, man, put y'all orders in, man. My Instagram is down in the description below, man. Y'all already know what to do, man. DM me when y'all if y'all want a shirt, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm shipping them out, making shipments. I'm doing deliveries if y'all local in my area or whatever the case may be. So, yeah, man. God, speak to the speedy tribe, man. Peace.